Ladies and gentlemen, get your suitcase together because we're headed to Mars. Thank you for joining me today in this video. Yes, we are doing another Galaxy Straight Pour, but can I do it with not so many dark colors? We're about to find out. All right, so this is Copper by Amsterdam, and you can see the consistency is nice and thick. This is a 2.5 parts ratio um, to one part paint. So. 2.5 parts floor trial to one part paint. That last color you saw was Parchment by Artist Loft. I no longer really use Artist Loft paint, so I'm trying to get rid of it. And so we're going to start layering our cup. This is my um, Titanium White by Amsterdam and Artist Loft Soft Body mixed together. And next we have 24 karat gold mixed with some yellow ochre by Dick Blick. So it's taking the vibrancy of the gold down just a little bit um, and adding that opaque layer so that the gold will show up and not change too much in color. This is Bordeaux Red. You know this is one of my favorites by Arteza. Super deep and rich. Love it, love it, love it. And this is Crimson by Blick. Some more titanium white. Followed by our gold mixture once again. And now we're adding a little bit of black. And I will go ahead and tell you that we actually won't see it <clears throat> in the painting. But I'm glad that I added it to really base that Bordeaux Red. So that is the little bit of dark that I'm adding. Um, and that's for the contrast. Because for the Galaxy Pores to work, you really do need some um, contrast to really get that depth. Okay. That is a custom mix red. And some more of our copper. And you can see, I'm just going to keep filling it up. I've also used some raw sienna. Uh, you just saw there. And that other copper color is by Blick. So you will find when you start buying coppers and bronze, they vary very, very much uh, by brand as far as the color. Like totally, totally different colors. And I think that's pretty cool. And so I am just using the rest of the paint in my cup and I'm going to add some more of the copper to it so that I can pour my cup into this. This will act as an extender and will start to spread out on our canvas. Oh, y'all know what we haven't done in a while. A tip of the day. So let's talk about the consistency really quick. Um, when you're using a standard ratio for your straight pours, ring pours, galaxy pours, one thing to note, when you get into a thicker consistency, your paints may not all be exactly the same, and that's fine. It will work. Um, what I do sometimes when I have mixed the paints ahead of time, the thinner ones I mix, I leave open overnight to thicken up. Uh, but whenever you use the standard um, ratio, you'll see a difference. Like my Deco Art satin enamels are normally a little bit thinner. Um, but you see in all my previous videos that it works out just fine. So keep that in mind. But if you are doing a ring pour, straight pour, galaxy pour with a thinner consistency, 
the the game changes it, it completely changes there's a whole slew of different rules in my opinion and that's kind of where people get caught up because you can do um these pours with a thinner consistency i prefer a thicker consistency especially to hang on to my fingerlings and get them to be really crisp So I wasn't happy with my center at first, so I kept pouring, and now I'm just using my skewer to fix it. Because remember, when you get to stretching out, that center is going to blow up, all right? So if you have something ugly going on in the center, you're going to have something ugly going on at the end of your piece. <laughs> All right, so I'm just turning this canvas around um, to get into the orientation that I like. I see what I want to do. I can see that galaxy opening up uh, from the bottom there once I move my cup out the way. See see that? that that's going to be the galaxy walking or, or spiring into another galaxy. So I want to use that as orientation to make my painting. And this is just leftover paint I'm using as a flow extender. You already know. <laughs> and while we are looking at this, friends, please join me at the Fluid Art Experience in Seattle, Washington. That is April 27th through the 29th. It is not too late to get a ticket. Um, I'm really thrilled with my classes so far. Um, we are going to have a lot of fun. I see some familiar people already coming back for a second dose, if you will. I, I did teach at the Dallas edition last year, and so I'm so happy to be back teaching again and debuting this Galaxy Pour class. So if you are not busy, come hang out with us. We will have so, so, so much fun, and it's just amazing time to be around artists. You really get to hone in and learn because the classes are three hours. You'd be surprised how fast the three hours will go by, but it will allow me to get some one-on-one -on -one time with you and to really nail the technique or the look that you are going for so that when you get back home, you can do it again. Ah. All right, so I'm going to tilt very slow here. The composition is absolutely gorgeous. I wish we could keep our paintings like this sometimes. And so I need to spread out my composition, but I don't want to lose it too much. So I am going to go side to side, and then we're going to kind of go in a circular motion and finish this thing on out. Now, I also have another event coming up April 14th and 15th. This is the Fluid Art and Abstract Retreat hosted by myself. Um, it is almost sold out. I haven't been talking about it much uh, simply because it's almost sold out. But you can join me in the lovely Wake Forest, North Carolina. Um, I have the information posted below. If you have any questions, please contact me. I'm going to treat you like the king and queens that you are. And I'm excited to see you there as well. So if you're on the East Coast, you got somewhere to meet me. If you're on the West Coast, you have somewhere to meet me. And I am always open to traveling if there are enough people in one area and we want to do some type of classes. So if you want to set something up, let me know. Shoot me an email.
and family remember do everything with love treat your friends your family and even your enemies with love and don't forget to book your ticket i will see you in another video very soon peace